Hi, it's Sue Greenwald with Awaken Stories. I'm here today with King Smarty. Hey, Smarty, how are you? I am fantastic. What's up, everybody? Ah, well, today is the 18th of December, 2023. We talked on the 13th, only five days ago. To me, that feels like an eternity. Like so right. much has happened in five days. And it, it feels like months since we talked to me. Uh like all right, so I've gathered lots of questions. I wasn't sure if you had any updates you wanted to give out first, or if you just wanted to start with the questions. Um, well, uh, things aren't going um, as they planned it, so that's a good thing. Uh, we're intervening everywhere, which is also a good thing, and um, we are definitely here. And you're going to see evidence of Daddy's hand in it all. So. That's um that's very very exciting times, and uh, once we get over this little bit of um, um, I would say controlled chaos because they're the ones that are in control of it, or they think they are. Um, uh, once once they once we get over all of it and everything is exposed, then we get to come in and do what um do what 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 I want to do which is totally um, take over everything in the public side and expose the truth about all of it everywhere. So that's where, that's where we're going. Um, there's, I'm sure there's, you all know that there's lots of updates, lots of things happening everywhere. Right. Um, but um, let's get into the Q and a real quick so we can right. answer as much questions as we can. Cause we know, cause yeah. I know that there's a lot of people wanting to get some answers so let's they are. i got a lot of questions this time so we're going to bounce a little bit but i've tried to organize it let's start with the moon <laughs> yet again <laughs> um, <laughs> um do we have the real moon back yet officially uh i wouldn't call it the moon but yes there's a ship there there's a okay. ship that did come back and the reason for it is because um, some of the dark ones were trying to take advantage of the darkness in the oceans oh. because the, the wild, you know, the, the not wildlife, but the beings in the oceans um, uh, needed light. So we had to, we brought it back. Oh, I saw your post on that. I wasn't sure if you meant whales and dolphin, mer people, ETs, whoever. And when you say they needed light, do you mean like down into the very depths of the ocean or... Um... Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not not too far down, but uh, the surface, the surface. Okay. So they lots need of, lots of, yeah, lots of different people and animals use that light to maneuver and blah blah blah. But that's the only reason why it was brought back. Okay. Uh, plus, it was it was done to it was done to show everybody that you know, um, dad. Dad's not playing and he wants certain things done. Right. And the people that needed to see it, they got the picture. So. All right. So basically it was gone for at least 10 days, the 10 days of darkness. And it was dark, by the way. And then, um, you know, we, you brought it back and now it's back to what we call normal, the regular moon, which is a ship, not a planetary body. Right. Right. Okay. Um. Had a question, does the moon affect the northern lights or the sundog phenomenon? No. Okay. So that's like a separate thing. Yeah. All right. All right. Is there a sun in inner earth, like a simulated crystal or a sun? It's Yes, it's a simulated crystal. Okay. And do they have a moon as well in inner earth? Okay. No. All right, we're motoring right through this, aren't we? Yep. <laughs> um, uh, do Dracos and reptilians have souls? Um, uh, yes, they're, they're they're they do have souls. Uh, they but but they're not the same as a, as a human um, soul, if you would. Okay. Wow. So when, when we take them and we send them to the ethers, that's literally their energetic body, which is what people call souls. Yes. Okay. Right. So it's like their energetic body slash consciousness, which is mm -hmm. their essence. So yes, 
uh, any living creature would have that. A clone does not have that. Exactly right. Okay. Okay. So they have souls, but for some reason, theirs are totally programmed different than ours are. Right. Okay. So ours are like, we'll call it, this is a horrible way to say it. We're more love and light and they're more like conquer, destroy, or do whatever they do. Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a program. Um, yeah. It's there's benevolent and malevolent. Right. We're right. benevolent. They're malevolent. Right. And you can't, you can't mix the two because if you do, you get chaos. Yeah. <laughs> and, since, and since there's more of us, the chaos is, um, what do you call? Um, it's it's the the their abilities to continue their chaos is shortening by the day. It, you understand what I'm saying? I do. Yeah. And then it's and then it's going to be completely wiped out where they're they can't even cause chaos because we are so loving and 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 the consciousness is is raising that we are not falling for their bullshit no more. Right. Right. Well, once the consciousness is raised and people understand what's happened, the theory is they'll remember that for future generations, right? And nobody will forget like what we have now. You know, it's right. our history has been totally uh, convoluted, Shanghai taken over. We've forgotten it. It hasn't been taught, whatever. I don't even know what the correct words are, but I think all of that, you know. All right. So, so. If 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 um if thoughts can kill and they can, uh, the entire world will destroy Israel because of what they're doing to the children and everybody's seeing it. So those of us that are benevolent, we don't want to see this type of stuff happen. Right, right. And we want Israel gone, and 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 uh, and it's not. Israelis, the innocent people. It's it's the ones that are in charge of what they're doing, the commanders, right. the ones mm -hmm. giving the orders, and the dark ones that are blatantly just fucking doing what they're told. Right. So that's that's literally what's um uh what's being um brought to the surface, and we're gonna get to the 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 cause of it all, which are the off-planet reptilian Draco type of beings right which are which are also low vibrational and malevolent so once once um um once everybody sees what what's what's what they what they're doing what they have been doing it's not going to happen no more because everybody's going to wake up to the fact and it, and everybody's not going to agree with what they're doing and they right. won't be able to get away with it no more right 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 and I, I think more, I think this event has really done so much to awaken the masses. I mean, uh, you know, almost everyone I talk to is just, they shake their head and they're sad about what's happening. They don't know the true what's going on behind the scenes. Of course, they're mainstream people, but no one likes it. No one likes to see this. Well, e even if they, because I've shut people down real quick, mm -hmm. just shut them down. Yeah. Even, yeah. even if, even if Hamas went and killed innocent people, these guys are bombing babies, okay? They're bombing babies, and there's a way to do things, which is which is another reason why they're blatantly going against all mm -hmm. types of laws, right. all types of laws, everything that was put in place to protect innocent people, okay? So they're... They're literally disregarding everything and they're going after everybody only because they want the natural resources and the land. Right. And this is this is what it's really about. And if you can't see that, there's something wrong with you as a being, as a benevolent humanity, right. uh, a human human being. Right. If you can't see nothing, not, not if you can't see that, there's something wrong with you. Right. Right. And that's that's where you yourself have to sit down and re restructure your life in the way you're thinking, because it doesn't matter at this point who did what it's who's doing what. Right. That's like a good you literally. Yeah. yeah. They're literally bombing children every day. They just bombed a children hospital and the U S was involved in that shit. Okay. So 
despite whatever you think about who's right and who's wrong or whose religious group is knows better than everybody, blah, 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 blah. What they're doing right now is not human. It's not humanity. It's nothing that us loving people right. would do. Right. So you got you're gonna have to um get it together and change the your thought pattern because if 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 you're in that state of yeah, but they did this. Yeah, but they did that. Then you're you're literally a part of the problem, right? And that's that's where that's why I say you're going to have to sit back and rethink your whole life because there's there's obviously innocent children being murdered and executed every day. They just released a, a video of uh, a massacre that just happened yesterday or this morning. And these people are not Hamas. Now they're talking about killing Hamas soldiers inside of their prisons. And we all know that those prisons are full of innocent people. Like these, these, these are some very, 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 very dark people doing this stuff. And, and the fact that they're literally going across the against the wishes of the entire planet, like, and I, I, I honestly don't like the UN or think that they're very effective, and they have a negative. Yeah, no, they're, yeah, they're all a part of the same shit. Yeah. That's why. That's why. That's why they're not doing nothing. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly why they're not doing nothing. And that that is also reframing certain people from doing things too, because you know we all want to do things. I want to do more myself and I'm like the last resort because when I, you know, when I get involved, it's like, you know, it's over, over. Right. Um, however, it's also showing us that the world that are the world leaders, so-called leaders are involved in it all. Every single one of them, every single one of them. Um, and that's a good thing too, because now the whole world sees who our enemies are. Right. Because they're they're pretty, pretty dark people and they don't care about nothing or no one. Right. So we as a collective have to continue to put it in their minds. What if this was your child? What if this was you? What if this was your family? Right? We keep hitting them with those frequencies to do that. And um we'll see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, look at we the Maui incident. OK, we see video of the dues coming down interviews. We we saw what happened there. Nothing was done. OK. And those people are still displaced They're You know, I talked with someone that used to be in insurance and I was like, they're not getting their money. She's like, oh, they've got to get their money. No, they're not getting their money. They're they're right. not they're not being treated fairly. So this is not a normal catastrophe, but they're doing it right out in the open. They don't care, right? That we're right, right, right. 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 Well, that's yeah. that's what I was saying the other day that they yeah. they, you know, we we would say they think they're above the law, right? But but in reality, they think they're above daddy. Yeah, yeah. Because we all know that they made the laws. Right. So that's why they feel like they're above the law, but they're not above that. And this is this is what they're all getting um, an eye opening experience of, um, which is which is why I continue to do what I do. And I, I literally beg daddy every day to do more. Right. Because if we if we would just uncloak all of our ships that we have all over the all over the entire earth. Everything was stopped. Just last night, Dad told me they don't want that. None of them want that. So they're they're doing the good guys. They're doing their best they can to, you know, um, expose things and get things out. Mm -hmm. But I'm at the point where I'm ready to eliminate everyone, every one of them, good and bad. Because you know, with me, it's like I I. I no. It don't matter if you're good, if you're so-called good. <laughs> It'd be reformed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, so, it just seems like everything, you know, all these years, blah, 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 blah. We're waiting, waiting, waiting. And there's a, a wait, you know, the plan is unfolding. Well, nothing ever unfolded, right? 
you know, the cute right. stuff and the decoding and blah, blah, blah. Nothing that they said ever uncoded. It was just controlled opposition. And um, now we're seeing it unfold big time. Well, that's that's what I've been saying since the beginning, since the basement. You know, they especially with me, both both sides are involved in censoring me. Right. right? And this is another reason why I continue to request to just come out and just show everybody who we really are. Uncloak our ships. Let's uh, let's shut everybody the fuck up. Let's shut them all up. Right. Because that's when literally the earth stays still. And we, we're the only ones that can do it. Right. However, we have to wait for dad's approval. And mm -hmm. I'm like, I'm so ready, so ready. So ready. <laughs> well, it's come. You can feel things drawing closer. I mean, yeah. It's in. The, you can feel it in the air. There's, uh, you know, it's good. It's a good thing. You know? Yeah, that's definitely. That's definitely. See, here's the thing. It's an inevitable, right? Right. Uh, um, and it's going to happen. I I just wanted to happen yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. we're we'll with you. You know, but I understand how things have to unfold and. They're revealing themselves in their plan. And of course, it's, you know, we've talked about the reptilians, like they're after the pain and the suffering of the people and, you know, evidently the bodies, which is mind blowing. But they're also after the resources of each area. So we know Palestine has lots of buried resources that will be revealed, as well as the land and location. But the same with, say, the Congo, the same with Hawaii. The same with any other area that they've conquered. And um, I, you know that uh, Tarzan movie that came out maybe 15, 20 years ago with the real, like the live action Tarzan guy. And um, mm -hmm. there was a scene there. Um, he, he goes on the back of a train and inside the train, there's all these people. They're all slaves. They've been captured, taken away from their villages. And they're, of course, they're using the resources of Africa, you know, the minerals and all of that, but they've used them as slaves for all these years, the yeah. suffering and all of that. And the greed, it's just inconceivable, really, you know? That's true. That's true. Yeah. And all yeah. these English guys were like all wealthy, like in these giant mansions. And they were, they didn't care what was happening to the people. You know? uh, that's because they 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 weren't English guys. They were reptiles, right. reptiles disguised as English guys. Right, right. Um, and that's that's always been the case with them. And you know, that's that's another reason why they do what they can do because they they don't have the resources that we um, that we have. Right. Uh, for instance, they're they're doing all this stuff in Palestine for natural natural gas and whatever else they think is there mm -hmm. same thing with congo mm -hmm. and and dad dad can have us just create energy products that just power everything forever and they they don't have those type of abilities or resources to do it and if they did they would probably just you know um kill the people that were making these devices <laughs> and they have uh, just to continue their their you know their feeding off the off the people, and and building their own wealth because they they just don't they don't have that connection the way we do. Right. Uh, right. Plus they don't they don't operate in love and light, so they won't you know they won't they have to be extinguished. They have to be eliminated. It's it's just no it's just like a like um like a rabid dog right. It, there's a dog running around the city biting everybody. The dog has to be put down right. because it's going to keep biting people. Right. And you've, the case. you've given them chances. So you, it's like taking the dog in, feeding it, taking care of it, giving it whatever it needs. And it still doesn't learn the lesson. It still is not learning the lesson. So the ones that are remaining are not learning their lessons. Yeah, that is that is the one giving them their chances. Because if it was up to me, they'd be gone already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you know, people, people don't understand how real that is. I mean, mm -hmm. the same way I can heal people, and I've healed thousands of people, thousands. And, and you know, there's a lot of people in our groups and follow me, and be be you know 
took the training and all that because I healed them, because I did things in a miracle which way for them. So yeah. if I can do that, what makes you think I can't do everything else I'm saying? Right, right. Yeah. So, and it, it's, it really don't matter if the people believe me at this point. We're so far ahead of that. It's, 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 it's just, it don't matter. We're going to continue to do it. We're going to continue to show people. And every time daddy um, uh, gives me the okay to remove people, they'll get evaporated, um, which, which happened this morning. A bunch of people got evaporated. And even the angels are saying, like, you guys, do you guys realize you evaporate people every day? <laughs> they, they look at us. They look at me and, you know, I look at, I look at B and, and they're like, yeah, we know. <laughs> well i said i said i feel bad in some type and you know for for i do feel bad because dad made them however i see the kids i see what they're doing and then all that feeling bad is just like out the window yeah so they said that they're going to kill all the people they have hostage in in jail in Israel right now. Yeah, they said they said they're going to kill all of the Hamas yeah soldiers in jail. Right, which is all of them, right? All of the ones they've captured. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, even the twelve year olds, seven year olds, six year olds. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I know we saw video a couple of weeks ago. They were taking like say nine year old boys, dragging them away, like. Who would do that? You know, horrible. horrible. Yeah. Uh, so we've talked a little bit about reptilians and they have a soul. You have mentioned vampires several times. And I wanted to clarify whether the vampires are the ones doing adrenochrome or if there is a separate uh, category or race of vampire. Like, just to clarify that a little bit. Um, yes to both. Um, it, it was, um, it was said that the vampires were, were stronger and, 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 um, in charge of even the reptilian types, uh, because of what they can do and what they did. And, uh, like the movies, um, they, they're, they're real. They're, they literally just like the movies. They teleport, they make people believe certain shit. They do this, they do that, um, shape shift. Uh, they do it, you know, that all that shit is real. Um, except for the garlic part. Now, the, the, the silver is what kills them. <laughs> all right. So they shape shift, they teleport, they do all of that. And the, and the reptilians are afraid of them. Yeah. Wow. Okay. I actually didn't expect you to say that at all. Yeah. I've said it a couple of times before, but yeah, um, they 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 were they were the ones in charge for a while. Okay, so, so they're like they're like they're like a fucking half breed type of, you know, a type of um, um, bat reptilian uh, human, all mixed up in one wild stuff. But they they're definitely real, and um, they were they were most of them were the Hollywood people. Yeah, yeah. The whole adrenochrome and shit like that, because yeah. um, not not all not all beings feed off of adrenochrome. Like even the reptilians, when they come into this reality, they have to feed, and what they feed off is the actual flesh of a human child. Right. Mm -hmm. So there's all there's all different there's all different types of different beings, just like there's all types of different humans that are vegan, blah, 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 blah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. And then all around the world, people eat different things. Yeah. And there's different races. I mean, we're, well, we're all human, humanoid, but you can you can obviously see the difference in us all. So the ones that are in, say, Hollywood or politics or the newscasters that are shapeshifters, those are generally the rep or the vampire ones because they're the ones doing adrenochrome. Yeah, they're, they're they're. I can't. You can't say that they're all, but they're yeah. mixed. Yeah, yeah, they're mixed. All right. Wow. Okay. 
they I, actually they actually fight each other too. That's why you see that's why you've seen some of the different things happening and the different power structures happening because you got you got the vampires, you got the Dracos, you got the half breeds, you got the the, the the reptilians, and that's why you got different groups like the Illuminati, the Rosicrucians, the fucking the Knights Templars. You got all these different being be, uh, uh, beings in these different groups, and they're all trying to fight for power. And then you got me coming on, coming along, and say, you know what? Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Thank you for doing that. Like a lot of these groups, we we are taught that they're they're really good and they're protectors and this and that. And um, maybe That's they what? started that way, but it got Shanghai or you know corrupted. You know. That's exactly what happened. That's exactly what happened. Wow. Okay. But okay. but we you know we we're coming. I mean we're here. We're we're here already and. They know we're here. They don't want you to know we're here. That's why they censor the shit out of me. Now, if you if you watch the David Adir interview, the second part just now, the 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 device that was in um, Area Fifty One, where he was where he was working on, it was a conscious um, being, a conscious ship, like I've been saying, right? And the ship tells him he's the ship is about 15 billion years old. Billion? Yeah, 15 billion years old. And that their their um their um family is coming for them. So I mean, if the ship is only 15 billion years old and I'm 500 plus billion years old, mm. so I guess their family is my family wow <laughs> wow there's a lot of ways we can go on this one exactly and if you notice if you notice he says that i keep popping up on him and he said in that video that dad said you're not going nowhere and that he enjoys watching you doesn't that sound familiar <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so we, we pop up on everybody and we tell them certain things and then we leave. Right, right. And right. you know, if you're if you notice, we call dad daddy. I, I slip to say dad sometimes, depending on who I'm talking to. And daddy loves watching us and we're not going nowhere. And we're gonna be here for a long time and there's gonna be some changes. Right. So he literally just said that in the video. And this was 1970 something where he was told all this, right? Right. Okay. Well, shortly after those things happened, I was born, 1978, and all of the the ships and everything that he was talking about are already here. We are all here. So, it's 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 very very exciting as you see all of these things come to surface, and then, you know, we're showing everybody it's all true. Totally. So Area 51, we haven't actually talked about that before, but, um, you know, everybody thinks there's a, they just have a spaceship down there, but they also do genetic experimentation. They have ETs down there living and deceased, and they do all sorts of nasty stuff that, you know, we probably don't want to know about. <laughs> Is that true? Yeah. The huge facility. And uh, yeah, they yeah, have ships, yeah. all sorts of technology, um, you know. It's like it's like the movie Resident Evil. Uh, I haven't seen that one. Yeah, there's all types of shit going on there. Um, gene splicing. Um, 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 uh, what do you call it? Ex experiments. You know how you know how over the years these certain types of experiments got out, and I would mm -hmm. say, yeah. Yep. That's an experiment. Daddy want me to do this and do that, that, blah, 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 yeah. blah. Yeah. So all of those experiments that daddy um, didn't want uh, created, he had me had have them turn on the people that were making them. And then after they turned on them and exposed them, the individual who made that particular being, um, after they did that, then I, I got rid of them too. Oh, 
Okay. So we're doing we're doing massive cleans up everywhere, and there's lots of different types of re-engineered um, spacecrafts and beings and all that down in there. So they've been using um, alien alien DNA or alien blood or alien with DNA and mixing it with humans and different types of animals and making these things that aren't approved of by that. Right. Like I said last time, it doesn't matter who claimed to make us. Daddy allowed us to be made because he made us at, at the end of the day. So you got these you got these people making these certain things that he doesn't approve of. And then I have to go in and clean it up, have them turn on the people who made them. After they're eliminated, I get rid of them, too. Right. Wow. Now, we've seen video of these babies that one was like it was part human, part tiger or something. One was like uh I think it was maybe reptilian. It was just horrific things. And um, that's just what we're seeing. So there's so much more that they're doing. And I know that some of the experiments that got out, there was one that was like a giant spider. There was one that was the size of a human, but it was like a bat. And yep. saw that hanging uh, on a tree or whatever. And um, I remember about five years ago, you put out a video of um, the, these people were in a cave and this, um, well, creature, um, maybe six foot tall thing, opened its jaw up. Its its mouth was huge, and it had someone's head and shoulders inside of its mouth. Yeah, and you told me that was real, and I totally creeped out. But yeah, yeah, they get out, you know. That's a, that's the type of things that we're that we we have to clean up. Yeah, because we can't let that type of stuff roam freely, especially what they're doing to you know, to, to, to the people. Right. That's why, that's why a lot of people go missing in certain areas around the world, especially national parks, because they release these type of uh, experiments just to see what they would do when they monitor it, it all. Mm -hmm. um, and then some of the half breed reptilians before they actually made them, they were experimenting on them. And some of them came out more reptilian than human. So they, they, you know, terminated it wow. until, until they made a half breed that looked at more human, but had all the reptilian features inside, right, right. which is why they say people have the reptilian brain. I don't know about you, but I don't got no fucking reptilian brain. <laughs> now, somebody said that to me. Now we've heard that, that certain parts of your brain are reptilian and somebody was like almost proud of it. I'm like, mm, that doesn't sound good. You know? Right. You no. Know? Maybe maybe part whale, but I swim like one. <laughs> well, you said last time that the whales and dolphins, like really, were the um, like they were the source of life here, and right. so I feel like there's more to that than I do that I don't know. I don't even know what to ask. Like, how do you mean that? You know, like how did they? help us keep life here on earth or i don't know if you meant just human life or all life yeah it's uh it's 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 all life um and we're we're like a see that that's the thing it didn't happen here on earth it happened billions of years ago which is why which is why we evolved into what we are now so okay i mean i mean, I mean the 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 the, the whales can actually astro travel through space and time dimensions, mm -hmm. you, you, you know, um, galaxies and all that stuff. So that's, that's, they're, they're literal, they're, you know, they're very, very special. So did you just say basically human life was created like off earth and brought into earth and then we evolved from there? Yeah, that's why, that's why, that's why we're, you know, that's why I'm so old. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, the oldest, the oldest human race is literally um, in um, Uranus. Hmm. The oldest human races are over there. And they're still there, by the way. Okay. So, um, so that's, that. yeah, that's another reason why I tell you that you know, all of the different races here on Earth landed here at some point in time. Okay. 
So are the ones on Uranus or however we say it, are they in inner earth or, or inner planetary or are, are they on the surface? They're on the surface and inside. Okay. So they're, they're, they're connected with each other the way we are, we are getting ready to be. Meaning we have free will. Everybody's on the same page. Nobody wants to do no harm to each other. And then different parts of, um, the, the, the earth is opening up to us. Um, um, I know maybe you haven't played video games, but when you play video games, there's levels and maps in each game or different, you know, like, for instance, Mario Brothers. I'm sure you played Mario back in the day. Yeah, like 50 so you know how to, Right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. So when, you, when you're playing Mario and you go up, you know, you go into a portal, you end up on another map. Right. Okay. That's literally showing you what the fuck this world really is. So you go, you, you play Mario and then you eat mushrooms and you do this and you do that. And then you go into a portal, you pop up on another map. Then you got to do everything on that map until you beat the map. Then you pop into another portal and go into another map. That's literally what's happening on Earth. Literally. And there's certain portals that you cannot go through because your mind isn't right. Meaning you're fucking evil as fuck and you're not allowed to go through. Right. And in our case, the whole until we get until I was about to say kill until we eliminate all of the darkness and the dark type of people and beings, we're not going nowhere. All right. So some of us can go because we have clearance to go off world and into other areas, right? Because I have the the highest clearance there is. Right. Yeah. That's a, that's another reason why dad tells me to tell the Jedi stop going to places where they shouldn't go to because they have no clearance and they can get killed. Right. If right. you go into the wrong area and the beings there don't approve of you being there, they will take your ass out because mm -hmm. you're not supposed to be there. This is what this is what what happens now. Once we're all on the same page, everything's cleaned up. Earth is being rebuilt. People are not hurting each other the way that the cabal is doing to us, then those portals, those those little, you know, jump gates or portals that happened in the Mario Brother after they completed the mission can open up. Once it's opened up, then you have the right to go to a different map. You got it? Yeah. So the other maps, we, we're already seeing that the other maps are real. And the Earth is way bigger than it is, like I've been telling everybody. We now have access to the other maps, the other places, the other districts. Oh, starting to get interesting now, isn't it? So interesting. Now, so here's, here, here's the cool part of it all. That's just Earth. It's just Earth. Now, when you start seeing my ships, they came in from galaxies away. And they're coming into Earth through portals, and then they'll be visible everywhere. That's where we're from, because we are literally the ancient ones. You know, they call us many things, just like I have many names. My original name is Sananda Galactic. I have many names, just like now I got many names. You know, people, everybody in my family don't call me Smarty. Right. <laughs> you know, they, they don't call me Smarty. They call me John, John, John. You know, different, you know, some of my friends call me different names depending on what I was doing or where I was at. Right, right. And, you know, everybody would say, oh, yeah, I know him. That's blah, blah, blah. Yeah, that's blah, blah, blah. I had a different name everywhere. Same thing throughout all this time. I had different names. Right. So right now it's King Smarty or Sananda Galactic, which is Lord Sananda. Same thing. I'm the same being. And uh, we're getting ready to reveal ourselves, and Dad's going to show his hand. And the only way, um, the only way that happens is when we, um, when everybody wakes up and we eliminate all the dark ones. I mean, it's happening at the same time. If you understand what I'm saying, I do. It, it's, but, go ahead. I'm so sorry. No, no, it's cool. It's cool. 
but but once 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 we get to certain levels of consciousness and certain things open up, is you'll see what I'm saying. Yeah, well, uh, I'm really intrigued by that. You know, we see these maps of the other districts and continents on Earth, and Ant Antarctica videos are coming out like crazy lately. And yeah. um, of course, we all want to know more. And um, so we we basically have to eliminate the darkness here in this district before we get to no more and then potentially travel to other districts slash wherever. Right. Yeah. Right. So before real quick, before before I opened up the, the, the glass dome, that's now energetic dome because the glass dome was taken down and then we put an energetic one up. Right. Um, they were trying to keep everybody from knowing all this and go outward. The reason why you're seeing more and more videos and, of Antarctica and people flying over it is because that threat is no longer there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, however, you, you still won't be able to go to a certain distance until dad allows it or dad approves it. Okay. But you won't have the threat of military, you know, shooting you down and the Admiral Byrd shit where these entities or these right. UFOs come out and just wipe out the entire army and shit like that. Yeah. Yeah. But because like I've been saying, we took care of all that shit. <laughs> so interesting, isn't it? So interesting. I I was a teenager when I read The Hollow Earth, Admiral Bird, Bird talking about the North Pole. And yep. then, um, like, you know, again, go about my life. And then I hit the, you know, when he talks about Antarctica and all that. It's so interesting that there, there's our, we'll call them prehistoric creatures roaming around there. Like, yeah. It, we're taught that they've all been wiped out, you know? Well, we, we've been taught a lot of lies, yeah. You know, I know. I'm really seeing the scope of how big that is. Like, every day, it's, like, bigger and bigger. And I'm like, whoa, nothing we know is real. <laughs> this, right. And this is, this, is, this is another reason why all of my work and all of my products will be, like, super, super expensive. Right. Because everybody's going to find out the truth of it all. And they're going to see the value of it all because there's only a limited supplies of everything, right? <laughs> <laughs> For now. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, some some of the products I won't even make no more. Yeah, yeah. And I, I literally just had a conversation yesterday because I was looking for a specific item for um, um, Genesis for Christmas, right? Uh, a gift that she wanted. And the prices are so high because I found out they stopped making them 13 years ago. Oh. So I was telling the guy, well, you know, that's why my, that's why a lot of my products will go up high too, because I only made certain, a handful of them. Yeah. And I'm not going to make no more because of stuff, stuff like that. Yeah. So if you got some of my products, especially the older ones, they're going to be very valuable, very valuable. And then when everybody finds out who I really am, then they're going to go, yeah, that's true. I, I've been trying to give a lot of mine away to people. So um, now I'm like, dang it, I should have kept it. But <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. We're right. ready up it's supposed to be, right? So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So we have the, the, the oldest human race out in our solar system. Um, all right. Skin color of... Of the majority of the human, <laughs> um, are they um, darker skinned there as well? Mm -mm. No. They're they're like um, olive. Olive. Wow. Okay. You got olive. You got gold. Um, you got blue. You got teal. You got brown. Uh, you got you got blurple, which is super dark. <laughs> Um, uh, all of the different humans have different colors because of the different atmospheres that they have. Okay. Um, even even um, even in inner Earth, they're a lot. Um, some of them are a lot darker. Some of them are white, and some of them are dark, depending on what part of the inner Earth you go to. Mm -hmm. And the reason for it because of the atmosphere, and they even grow bigger. They grow taller and the fruits grow bigger because of the, the atmosphere and the energy, which is nothing but energy. So um, 
uh, this is another reason why we can breathe in anywhere we go because it's just it's just energy. So once you go into a certain area of the universe and you come into that energy field, your your atoms and everything change so that you can um, literally um, live in that area or breathe in that area. So there's there's nothing to worry about as far as breathing in space, okay? And even even the Aquaman movie showed you that you can breathe underwater if you learn how to do it. And it's just like focusing on you literally turn into a different a different um, being or a different species. Um, so there's multiple different colored beings out there, and there's already um, evidence of it all documented by the um, U.S. militaries. Uh, just just last night, I had requested that Dad have them release all the different. Um, data and uh, evidence that they have on all the different species last night and daddy of course said green in green um, so that's what I did I reinforced it and I'm about to take a screenshot and show everybody that's what I do I do this shit every day all day long wow. command 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 mm -hmm. that's literally what my job is that's why they I'm the supreme commander um, but it's going to be interesting because you're going to see beings that look like um, the old Roman times, the Egyptian times, and it's literally nothing but beings that wore these type of things on their planet. So it's going to be normal over there. Wow. That's, probably, that's, that's probably why you, you keep seeing me in a toga outfit because we're not going <laughs> to... <laughs> We're just going to be super comfortable and some of the stuff that we wear is just going to be like, ah, we don't need that shit. Let me just throw this on. Yeah. So, you know, we, right. um, we, we, uh, we, I mean, we'll, everybody will still have options. There's so many things that haven't been um, disclosed to us. Um, there's super, there's super advanced technology that some of these planets and beings have that once they do come in contact with us, their communications will be super, super smooth and easy because they'll just slap on a, a, a wrist or slap on a communication mm -hmm. device and just start talking to us. The, the, some of them mostly talk telepathically, so you'll start to hear them talking and then you respond to them, which is another reason why even um, a telepathy is coming, is hitting the forefront. You know, people are starting to communicate telepathically, whether they believe it or know it or not, it's happening. And there's 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 evidence of that coming forward, too. Right. That's You know, so it's all exciting. It's all happening. And it's, you know, for the people to say, oh, there's nothing happening. Where are you at? <laughs> <laughs> so, so it sounds like Earth is going to be like a big um I don't know, way station, uh, embassy, all these different races are going to come. Melting pot. Yeah. And yeah. it's going to be kind of like, you know, Star Wars, Star Trek, when all the races are doing whatever they're doing and they, they're they all getting along and communicating. And That's right. That's, that's right. That's exactly what it's going to be like. And some yeah. of the, some of the other, um, break off civilizations won't even be a part of it because of what they stand for and what they do. And you, you hear about these break off civilizations because of the secret space program. Right. You know, you got these Nazis and shit going to different places and blah, right. blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. Those type of areas will stay like that until, you know, we go in there and change that too. But earth will be a melting pot of, you know, of, communicating and meeting and advancing and living in peace and all that, which is why the first public embassy will be here, which is why a lot of the things that will be first will be here. They got these secret space bases all around the world where they come in and out, including we do. We do too. Okay. We got different bases coming in and out underneath their bases, beside their bases, watching them the whole time. Right. <laughs> but but like I said, now we're going to do things in the open where 
here's a galactic base. Here's what's happening here. Would you like to interfere? So. And, and I, I, I like to think that once these other races come and we interact and we, uh, you know, we start to build the new reality, you know, uh, and everyone starts to live that way, they will never let the darkness back in again. You know what I mean? Right, 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 right. Well, th that's that's another. That's I'm glad you brought that up because that's a that's that's a point. That's a valid point. Where the ones that we do come in contact with are not like that. The ones that are the ones that we we have been in contact with without us realizing it because they are in control of everything. What do they do? They do everything in the darkness. They lie about shit. They steal. They conquer. They do this. They do that. They, kill. they, they yeah. genocide. They kill. They do all of it. Right. And they, like I said, they keep their cells in the dark, thinking nobody can see them. Even when we take some of these guys out that have all of these different shields and all that stuff, they say, how did they see us? How did they find us on their way to the ethers? <laughs> how did they how did they know we were here? Um you know that thing I keep talking about called daddy? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Daddy. I didn't mean to call you thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. This it, it sounds so beautiful. And you know, it's going to be interesting to see olive skin, teal people, you know what I mean? Like, um, yeah. like it reminds yeah, first, me of Guardians of the Galaxy. You know, you've got. Exactly, exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Well, first, 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 we'll start doing it gradually, like on film and video. And here's a planet. Here's on this planet. Here's another planet. This is what they do here. This is what it is. That way we can get the people's consciousness and they're, they're, they're them ready for it. Right. Okay. And it starts okay. happening, right? And dad, dad want me to. He literally wants me to. He he wanted me to tell all of you guys all this shit right now because he wants everybody to see and realize that he's here. This you know, despite what you're seeing in the news and what's happening in Israel and Congo and all around the world, he's here. He's in charge, and. From here, we get to have all of these things I'm showing y'all. Because I'm not just telling y'all. I'm literally showing y'all for those that can see. You can see it. And you can feel it. It's real. <laughs> it, feels like, it feels like we're this close. Like you can feel it. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> it's, it's, it's excitement. It's it's um, um, validation, um, vindicated, um, yeah. all yeah. that on top of each other. That's what it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is excitement. Um, wow. Okay, I look forward to that. And and so what you're saying is, people will pretty much portal to these other areas, or they'll come here via portal, or however we so teleportation or whatever. Um, yeah, I, we got, we got, we got to, we got to make it seem like that's how, it, you know, we got to make it seem like that's how it, it is. When it's not, they can, they can just come in and go, just like, just like the medical wands. Okay, the medical wands, you use it on your people, friends, or family, yeah, right? Yeah. However, when you realize that you don't need the medical wand because you can do it yourself, right, 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 then. You're, then your consciousness expands to even bright or uh, broader. Right. right. And you remember two years ago, I literally told everybody that dad is having me make these products so that the people can see what we can really do. Right. And I've always said these are not permanent things. These are right. tools to get us where we need to be. Right. So that's what it is. So the portal basically will be unnecessary down the road like right right, right. we're gonna have met we're gonna, like you said basically like a public um portal system initially like we're taking baby steps then we portal individually and then we'll like bing, just teleport that's right that's right way once, convenient yeah once we once we get things going 
it'll happen faster and faster and yeah. faster, kind of, mm -hmm. kind of like this year. Yeah. The beginning of this year, we didn't know all the information we know at this point, right? And then we, we a lot of the darkness has been uh, brought to the surface and, um, um, you know, um, uh, uh, eliminate. Right. So that's that's literally what we've been doing behind the scenes, putting the energy to expose things, leaking stuff here, having people do this, having people do that, which is also exposing everything. So then me and my crew can eliminate it totally. Yeah. If you if I looked back at myself even a month ago, totally different. Uh, understanding, consciousness, level of knowledge, whatever you want to call it. It's, it's and he and and he just did two more levels. Yeah, yeah. Okay, two more levels. Hello, <laughs> what's that? What's that tell you? That means that means we are we are graduating quickly now. We're fast tracking. We're fast tracking, and I've been telling y'all this from the beginning that we are fast tracking because what they've done to us right. all of the technology they suppressed all of the different inventors that they killed now we're going to have the most awesome shit and we're going straight to the top so we are fast tracking yes wow well and, and you know you're talking a lot about like if people don't believe you if all right the moon was gone for 10 days you took the moon away all right there is no one else that I know of, not even technology can do that, right? So that should be enough proof that, hey, maybe smarty means business. You know what I mean? But like oh, yeah. I said, we're seeing what you've talked about within days come out right. in the public eye, you know? Right, 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 right. Even, even, you know, even they're noticing it on certain, you know, my phone calls. That I talk about certain things, and then um, it, it, there it is. Yeah, you know, it, like like just this just this morning, I was telling B that you know David Deer is talking about us popping in and popping out and blah blah blah. And I'm going in there and say, man, get your fat ass up off the couch, get to work. <laughs> and after watching the video, everything that I just told B, he said it. Yeah, he is he, he calls me JC, but you know. That's because I haven't really sat down with him yet. <laughs> I actually like him. I like the way, like he's a regular guy. Um, but I like, you know, I like the way he talks and all that. I've seen him interviewed many times on, uh, I think it was Gaia. Um, well, he, he, he's he been chosen to do what he's doing. And it's true. Daddy is laughing at him, making fun of him. Yeah. Um, he's not going nowhere. Yeah. Um, if you listen, if you listen, he even says that she told him that, there's some don't do that he said that there's um there's um uh, she said that there's some big changes coming right and he's not going nowhere and the changes are because he will be using the chambers and getting his new body along with us and he's I got a lot of work to do with us too yeah yeah i know he has um he had a whole bunch of health problems recently, and um, yeah, so good, good. That's why that's why Daddy laughs at him. Yeah, because you know people and the people around him. Yeah, just like yeah. us, he laughs at us. We we you know we worry about certain certain things, and then it doesn't fucking happen. Right, right. This um just just yesterday somebody was concerned about the whole process and that they. They have doubt in, in the military and blah, blah, blah. And I told him, I says, I says, you know what? At the end of the day, me and you live forever. So it doesn't matter how long it takes. Right. And then he's like, okay. you're right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, he, yeah. He, you're right. You're right. Yeah. Forever is a long time. It's a, it's kind of a hard concept to grasp, you know? Yeah. So well, I mean. And, and that's why I say we, we do live forever. However, we were changing from bodies to bodies to bodies. Since this is the last cycle, we are now turning into um, indestructible um, butterflies. Yeah. Wow. With the crystalline body. Was, 
everybody knows that diamonds are one of the hardest substance on, on earth, right? And our bodies will be literally crystalline based like diamonds. Right. And, you know, it, it, it's, it, it's, it even gets stronger than that, you know? So there's, there's, um, there's hard materials out there that are indestructible when we have the frequencies for it all. So I don't really, it don't really, um, I'm not worried about nothing. I understand how some people are because they don't have that understanding that we do. Right. You know, if you, and that's why I keep sounding like a broken record. Yeah. If you know that daddy's real, if you know that all things are possible, what's the rush? He already gave you your, your um, redemption. He gave you life. He gave you me. You understand what I'm saying? And I'm teaching everybody that with him, we don't have to worry about certain things. Right. So stop, hurry up and waiting and get your ass back to work. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But you don't understand they don't they don't have the the broadness of knowledge that you do. Although I think it's I think these videos are really helping people because um, you know, we're I'm answering the, you're answering their questions. You know, right, you. right. But another thing, like I've, I've done plenty of these videos. Some yeah. of them you can still see. <laughs> Go do the research. Listen to what I've been saying for years, not just yesterday, yeah. not just last month, not just two months ago. Yeah. Listen yeah. to everything that I'm saying. And then you realize that, you know, we do we do live forever. We are nothing but energy. Um, we're working for dad. We're working with dad. Um, and uh, we don't have nothing to worry about. We just have to continue and have faith right. and do our part, which is healing the people and those around us. Right. Um, I, I posted earlier about um, the Jedis. I know that there's a lot of people in there that are not, you know, that are faking the funk. What do you think is going to happen to them? I mean, the ether is, is, is real. Ooh. So... So you're faking to be of you're faking to be of, of the light and do do daddy's work or you're getting compromised. Where do you think you're going to end up at? This is very real. This ain't something that's going to drag out for fucking thousands of years like it has been. This is the last cycle and you're 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 literally playing with fire and you don't know how much trouble you're in. Like this is serious. And for all of you that are worried about these type of Jedis, let it go. Because when we do certain events or certain things take place, um, they won't be there because they're obvious. Right. So don't worry about them. Mm -hmm. Worry about what daddy wants you to do. Focus mm -hmm. on healing. If we, if we put out a certain request, focus on that. Help us do this. Help us do that. Don't worry about nothing else. Okay. I'm anybody glad you text, said that though. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody yeah. text you on some crazy stuff that doesn't feel right, ignore it. Right. Move on. Right. And, and and at the end of all this, we'll see who, where, when, and why. Right. <laughs> right. Right. It'll be a parrot. Um, now with the crystalline chambers, when uh those of us that are lucky enough to go get to go through them, uh, will we We'll kind of um, direct Daddy in what we want our appearance to look like, but he has the ultimate choice. And is that going to be permanent, or will we be able to, like, say, "Hey, I want to have blue eyes" or whatever? You know, like, sh will we be able to change our appearance for cosmetic reasons? I guess is a good way to say it. Um, you'll be able to do some to a certain extent. Yes. All right. All right. Hold on. Done, done, done. Now, I'm going to show you. All right, hold on. Matter of fact, let me. I'm just going to. Yeah, let me let me do this. All right, go ahead. Go ahead with the next question. While right. I finish this. All right. We talked um, about having children, like once we have the crystalline bodies. Uh, will be that be done the old-fashioned way? Will it be... Um, uh, done by like uh light like how will we have children i guess is the way to say it. i mean there's multiple ways if my memory serves i just wanted to answer someone's question there 
Okay, well, that's simple. The, 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 there's, there's multiple ways to do it. And um, the, the, coolest, the coolest way is to form them. Uh, what I mean by that is me and whoever's chosen will get together, put their hands like this, and the baby will form right there and then. Wow. That's what you call in a, a real energetic um, light conception. Right. Okay. I mean, there's there's real ones, but that's what that's that's literally light conception. Okay. Where 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 you're not doing the you're not doing the regular normal way of conceiving. Mm -hmm. You're doing it energetically. Okay. And that's done by thought and energy. All right. And that that um that's a lot long. That's way down the line because people have to realize that those things are even possible. Yeah, okay. And they have to have enough energy, enough love and light energy to be able to do that shit. All right. Uh, and, I, you know, that's not a lot of people there right now. Mm -hmm. Probably won't even be there because some people won't even be able to focus. Let me get this real quick. All right. All right. Uh, I'm on. <laughs> All right. So, so when we go into the, um, so when we go to the chambers, well, we have a consultation before we go in that will explain all this to us. All right. all right. And then we'll know when it's time to have children we'll, and we want them. We'll figure, we'll figure it out. <laughs> well, maybe, maybe, maybe after the chambers, you guys will be able to do it more. But if, if the people, you know, if certain people don't go into the chambers, they won't, they won't be able to do it for a long time to come because, it's, like I said, it has you have to have a lot of energy to be able to do that. Right. And and there's nobody on earth right now as where we're at that have that type of energy to do it. Right. Besides me, and you know, I'm not allowed to do it yet. Right. Right. Is that how you're going to have all your future kids? Uh, yes and no. No. Oh. Because, like I said, we'll, we'll be able to do it in a way where, you know, we the normal, and then we got those options. Right. Uh, okay. We also have options where there could be more than one individual, more than two individuals, I mean. Okay. So that, that way we all have our genes in that specific being. All right, real quick, so you can, so you can, uh, Genesis says, wants to say hi. Oh, my hi. God. How, how are you? Good. How are you? Good. Oh my they get they getting ready to go shopping. She wanted to say hi before before they left. I haven't seen you in years. You've gotten so big. <laughs> Just mind blowing. She said bye. <laughs> mind blowing. You know? Yep. Wow. Wow. Okay. So all right. So basically. We'll have a consultation. We'll look. We'll live for basically a thousand years. We can change some of our cosmetic appearances. Yep. Um, we'll have babies the old-fashioned way. Slash, there will be other options way down the road when our vibration is high enough. Right. Okay. My my my. What what I would what I would say is after the chambers. Then because after the chambers you become stronger energetic wise. Right, right. So yeah, after that. Yeah. Um, I have read about that, the light conception. Uh, I read it differently than like you say, you hold your hands up like this. I heard that you had to, I don't know, uh, like meditate, like as a group, everybody had to meditate. And then, um, I don't know, it took a lot longer to form a human that way. But um, uh, it, it all depends on, you know, on what group you're listening to, blah, yeah. blah, blah. But, yeah. yeah. Okay. You know, that dad does light conceptions all the time. And mm -hmm. those of us that work directly for him were made by him for that purpose. So most of them were light conceptions as well. Okay. Um, and plus, you do need energy to form a child. No matter what, no matter which way you do it, um, but that way 
is the is the most coolest and fastest way to form the child right as um you know right there and then and then if you're strong enough you can form them this size oh hello beautiful hello <laughs> say hi hi so beautiful yeah wow. yeah yeah they came to say bye before they before they go out and spend my money that's all right <laughs> you know it's that time of year <laughs> she should go out and buy whatever she wants <laughs> yeah 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 well soon 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 everybody will be able to do that you know that's yeah. why that's why we're working hard so that you know we live we liberate the planet in a way where none of us have to worry about certain things yeah yeah. And that's another thing that I was going to bring up earlier as far as, you know, the technology that we can have and, and produce and give away for free. We won't have to worry about water. We won't have to worry about light. We won't have to worry about people dying because everything is a frequency. You saw that video that I just posted about, you know, the different wars and people were stopping certain things because of the water and water was important. So... What do you how, how how do you stop people from generating water out of the thin air? You can't control these people no more because we we can we can produce water out of thin air and with a couple of cool you know gadgets we can power up the city. Yeah. So they lost. They lost a long time ago, but obviously dad wanted this to play out so that we as a you know, we as a species on Earth here can learn all this stuff and become stronger than the rest of the people out in the universe. And that's literally what where we're headed. So we're literally one of the strongest. Um, uh, we're literally one of the strongest human race that are graduating quickly. And we will have a lot, a lot of things to um, take care of and do. Wow. Yeah. Well, you know, we've talked about this before. Just think if uh, a business, a school, a mall or whatever, doesn't have to pay for electricity, gas, water, that reduces their expenses, which theoretically they pass that savings along to, to the consumer. But then you think of, um, wouldn't it be nice, like most of us are careful with air conditioning and and heat, right? Because we don't want to pay a big bill. Wouldn't it be nice to have your house warm or cool the way you want it without having to worry about waste like burning fuel that's crazy like that is crazy there's that's, been no improvement in a hundred years you know and that's 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 been done on purpose i know cave, it's caveman shit yeah just like a, a car the hybrid gets kind of what a regular gas vehicle does maybe a little more but we've had cars for over a hundred years and of course, we know the inventors have been, you know, killed. Their their research taken, and uh, it's it's horrible, you know. Well, that's that's an, that's another reason why I'm here doing what I'm doing, yeah. because they're not going to be able to stop me, right? At all, right. at all. So and we'll progress. Right, right. We will progress, and mm -hmm. once certain entities, as far as companies, realize that fact. That, that this man could not only protect us, but he can help us and he can, you know, put my two cents into things, right? Because that's my, pur my, pu my purpose. Right. Then they'll realize that they can do whatever they want to freely of anything because daddy and I are protecting them. Mainly daddy, you right? Mainly dad. So this is what's going to happen. That's and we, we're here. Yeah, we're even going to do things in a way where we're just going to produce things and give it away. We'll give it away to certain people, have them use it. Then somewhere along the line, we'll put it for sale, just like I've been doing with the products. Yeah, yeah. So same thing. It's just going to get bigger and more advanced things and, you know, um, um, products that don't need to be you know, don't don't take a rocket scientist to have to manufacture. 
So things are going to change. A lot of the companies are going to realize that they now have freedom to do certain things as daddy allows, because they're not going to be able to make malevolent shit no more. Right. So all of the all of the weaponry that's being spent over there in Israel won't even be reproduced anymore because there's no need for it. Right. So this is, you know, that's another reason why um, certain things are happening. Um, we, we literally won't need any type of weaponry like that because everybody's going to be reconnected to dad. We're all going to operate in love and light and um, that type of shit will fade away. Right. But there's a lot of things that will fade away, which is why I say that the earth has already been liberated. We're walking into that reality. Beautiful. It is beautiful. It is beautiful. So much, so much, so much. Mm. So, so, so much fun. So much fun. A lot of work, but it's going to be fun. Yeah. Well, you've been tireless with what you've been doing. And I, I'm so grateful for that. You know, like... You haven't taken a break once, you know. No, no. I was just I was I'm I'm on the beach right now, and I haven't went to the water, in, you know, since this shit started. <laughs> <laughs> since this bullshit started. <laughs> if um if someone has origins, uh, let's say they have angelic or fairy origins or or they were part of, say, a blue race of humanoids or whatever, and they're here with us in the Jedis or whatever now, and they go through the chambers, will they come out with wings or blue skin or, uh, you know, whatever, like partial characteristics of that original life? Um, any, anything is possible. I just don't see that happening right away okay. for those for those individuals. Okay. Uh, be because the earth has to be educated first right. of different uh, beings. Right. I, I think if somebody walked around in with blue or purple skin or olive right now, um, of course, people would be probably afraid for the most part. But then assuming that we still had police government, uh, they'd be captured and studied. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't be a pretty thing. You know? Like they've been doing. I know. I know. But uh it's it's gonna happen. There's 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 no there's no stopping that. It's it's gonna happen, just like there's no stopping the uh the reptilian factor being exposed. It's it's gonna happen. You're gonna see videotapes of them, you know, being apprehended, being um, you know, transforming in handcuffs and being taken out and all that shit. It's gonna happen. There's no way around this that's what that's what full disclosure is all about now they wanted disclosure but they wanted to do it their way partial right we we all know this i've been telling you all this however dad wants an honorable full disclosure so what do you think is going to happen with me here enforcing it it's I'll going come to out, a, baby. <laughs> it's, going to, it's going to be a full, honorable disclosure, whether right. they like it or not. Right. The more, the more they get with the program, which is Daddy's full, honorable disclosure, the more they get to stay on Earth, or should I say, the longer they get to stay on Earth, because some of these individuals that turn to Daddy still have an expiration date. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. And it's because there was a certain cutoff point and we passed it. Okay. And that's why. Um, mm -mm -mm. Not, I'm not sure what, you know, where their souls will go afterwards. Right, but it won't be here. Okay. Maybe you you still you still may actually. What's happening now is that a lot of the people that were given these chances and still haven't turned are going past the ethers and ending up in Pebble Valley. Yeah, I would at this point. Yeah, like you gave a 
two 36 hour warnings last week and they missed those deadlines. <laughs> yep, yeah. yep, yep. And a lot of them are already gone. Yeah. Some some turned, some 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 decided not to. Okay. And uh, you, you, you're going to see more and more evidence of it all because certain people are no longer being um, shown or being seen. So it's all it's all happening. Right. It's all happening. And I don't care. I don't care who it is. I do not care who it is. And they know I don't care. I talk about it all the time. No matter who it is, there's nothing more powerful than that. You turned your back on him, and now you're going to feel the wrath of his son. <laughs> All right. Um, would you say time is speeding up? Um, I, you can say that, but it's actually, it's actually um, – um, things are happening a lot quicker. Not that time is speeding up. It's just more and more things are happening. Okay. Plus, uh, plus, uh, you know, the calendar is all bullshit too. I do know. Yeah. So, so it's just, it's just more and more things are happening. So it feels like it's speeding up. It's kind of like, all right, everybody knows when you have fun, time flies. Right. Okay. So when when so many things are happening and we're focusing on certain things, it feels like time is speeding up. But what's happening is we're having fun. Especially those of us that are like, oh shit, what's this? Oh shit, what's that? Oh, oh, oh shit. <laughs> By the time we know it, some of us forgot to fucking eat food. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is never my problem. But um, Not either. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It seems like, you know, when I was a kid, of course, we didn't have all of the technology and all this stuff going on. It was a slower pace of life, but it felt like the days were longer. Um, like we had three big meals. We had snacks in between. We had, you know, it just felt like a different pace. And now it's like I finished breakfast and next I know it's dinner time. And I'm like, what do I even get done today? You know, it's, it's yeah, going real fast. You know, right, right, right. And that's because now you have so many things to do. We're multitasking. So it feels like time is speeding up. Okay. Um, try, try sitting in a jail cell for two years. Yeah. Time don't go nowhere. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> that's what it's like. Yeah. All day long. Yeah. So again, you know, time feels super slow for those individuals that are like, that are in jail or in bed and not doing nothing yeah okay so for those of us that are doing things it feels like time is speeding up because we're actually involved in multiple things and we have to get things done we have to get that done we got to get this done and by, by the time we know it it's nighttime and we got to start all over again tomorrow <laughs> it's like groundhog day like I'll, I'll 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 see the same person the next day, and it was like I just saw you ten minutes ago. Oh wait, that was yesterday. It's so bizarre, the feel. Yeah. Of it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, can angels look any way they want, and do they have wings? Um, I've already alluded to the fact that they don't have wings, and yes, they can appear any way they want to. Right. Right. Just wanted to clarify. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, there was a question about how many times you've been back since you were um, the person, the being Jesus. And I, I think that might be a hard thing to give numbers because you've probably been popping in and out. I don't know if you've lived full lifetimes here. Yeah, I, I would say about maybe 11, 12 times since. Oh, OK. I would have said a lot more than that. Yeah, well, um wow, okay. But you see, I have I have <laughs> again, the universe is massive. I got other shit to do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I'm I'm you know, for instance, when I go to bed at night, I'm going to see my families elsewhere. You know, so I, I've got a lot of things to do. So 
Mm. You know, there's only certain, and this is this goes for all of us. If you're on Earth right now, um, a lot of us are old souls, just not as old as me and some of my crew, and we have lives and things going on all around the universe. So, you know, when I go to sleep, I go visit this family, that family, my kids over there, my kids over here, this and that, blah, blah, blah. And, it, you know, even, even my kids in other realms will be coming here to visit too. And they're going to be like, oh, that's your dad. That's my dad too, the kids. So it's it's going to be crazy. I mean, it's going to be real, real wild and crazy where people realize the whole scope of it all and how we are multi, multi, multi-dimensional beings and we have families elsewhere and um, we we will we'll be here too. And uh, as far as us, as far as this being a, the last cycle, we get to merge into ourselves which is why um, we'll be permanent after this. And then we'll be able to go to different parts of the universe um, looking the same way that we're going to look after the changes. Okay. So when you go to sleep, I know you're different than us because you're doing a hundred, literally a hundred things at once, but Let's say you're going to go see a, that family. Now, you're only sleeping, let's say, four hours here on Earth. And you go over there. How long are you over there for? Does it seem more than four hours? It can be It can be four hours. It can be a month. It can be a year. Okay. Because it's, it's different everywhere. It's different everywhere. And, and it's, it's, you know, dad, dad designs... <clears throat> He, he made me in such a way where I can multitask and um, still function as fast as you know I'm supposed to. Right. So, yeah, I don't even have to be sleeping to do that. That's another thing. I can be going down the road and he'll just take me and I'll be like, what the fuck? Come back. Like, OK, what was that about? <laughs> like I said, I see you blip out when we're talking sometimes, you know, and um you know, it's like less than a second. Yeah. And then especially when I got the heat on my ass, when that then I have to drop everything that I'm doing and figure out who's not doing what, what needs to be eliminated, what need, who needs to be healed, um, you know, just what I have to do. So I have to literally drop everything and focus on what needs to be done in order for the heat to dissipate. <laughs> <laughs> that's real man that's real it's, uh really complex and kind of hard to understand so it's, um it's a signal and, it's a signal to get your ass back to work <laughs> not that i mean the time thing and the, oh. the multi-dimensionality <laughs> and the portals with the donkey kong layers you know like um i use donkey kong as examples too because it's simple you know Same or, thing. yeah even Pac-Man, right? Yeah, After you're Pac-Man. done, do, 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 you go on to a different level. Do, do, right. do, 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 do. Well, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. That's all it is. Okay. So, 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 <laughs> if you think about it, we're on the first level. Yeah. Once we're done cleaning everything up, boom, we go to the next level. Right. But when we get to the next level, we'll have all of our abilities, know-how. And then boom, 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 boom. You keep going on levels and levels and levels. And we have to, like our purpose, the ones here on Earth, we become the galaxies, I mean, the guardians of the galaxy. There's already some out there, but they're not as powerful as us. They can't do the things that I can do and the things that I'm teaching y'all to do. So that's another reason why they're all looking in on us. Because wow. they they know our future. They know where we're headed. And the people here don't even know where we're headed. But right. they do. Right. Which right. is why they are watching us in excitement because they know that we're going to join them in, in the benevolent forces and eliminate some of the dark ones that are causing all of the harm across the universe. And the way we're going to do it is by thought. 
they can't do it like us. They definitely can't do it like me because they say it every day. How did he do that? <laughs> <laughs> and the fairies, fairies, they go, the fairies go all across the universe and they tell people, I told you, we told you, we told you he was coming. We told you, we told you he was real. <laughs> he did it to us. <laughs> so a fairy that is say here can go anywhere in the universe? Yes, because they're multi-dimensional beings, which is why you can't see them now. Okay. Wow. My mind is blown. Yep. Okay. Yep. We we talk about timelines a lot and you know, so we got realities, dimensions, and timelines, but uh the way it, you've made it sound is like we're going to one regular main daddy's timeline. And yeah. it, it sounds like the the dark forces try to splinter the timelines to their favor. And that's not working. So you're somehow condensing the timelines? Uh, they have been doing that, and we did. Okay, okay. So um, will there be time travel in the future <laughs> okay i can't even understand yeah, yeah. yes 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 there will be but it won't be like what's what what we have been doing yeah okay um I, i'm gonna give you i'm gonna tell you why i say that is because the time traveling that we've been involved with now is to come come back and forward like we can do it we can do it normally like that's that's normal for me right I can go into the future, describe a whole city remote viewing, and it'll be the actual thing because of who I am, because of me, right? Then I can go back to the future, back into the past, and tell you everything that happened, and then be back here in less than you know half a second, right? So the future time traveling will be us. Um, going back to revisit everything that we did and had to do. It won't be coming back to fix things. Change it. And be on missions, right. Mm -hmm. And then the same thing with the future. You'll be able to go on future trips and then see certain things that daddy allows you to see and then come back. Okay. Because you won't be able, you won't, when you move into the future, you won't be able to alter things. You'll just be able to go into. Observe. Um, right. Observe. Okay. Okay. So, wow. so right now, right now we've been doing we've been doing it as a galactic, um, oper uh, mili you know, gal galactic type of thing, operations and stuff like that. Right. Um, but once we get to a certain point, then it'll be allowed to do but observing only. And even if you was to do it and change certain things, I'll just come along and fix it anyway. It won't be dramatic as it is now. Um, one of the reasons why we actually had to do this, and I explained it before. So we moved into the future. However, we didn't clean up the bases and all of the stuff happening on the ground with all the children, all of the adrenochrome, reptilian harvesting and all that stuff. We had an RV. We did this. We did that. We repaired some of the parts of the world, but then we still had problems. Those problems are what we are eliminating now. Because of those problems, we weren't able to go from the from the twelfth level video game to the thirteen because we forgot to clean the shit over there. So we had to stop here, go back, totally clean the board, then move. Now we're free to do whatever we want. So because we knew what the issues were what the uh, root causes of the issue, we could come back to the timeline. We I see how I've included myself in that group. <laughs> it's the truth. I always felt like we have come back in time. Like right. I, I asked you this about five years ago, but we've come back to the times and maybe like you've gone back 20,000 years prior to plant the seeds for what's happening now to happen. That's know? right. That's exactly what happened. Okay. 
And yeah. you know, when, once we got to the certain, let's say we got to um, to level twelve, right? Video uh, a video map board twelve, whatever you want to call it. Once we had a level twelve and we couldn't go through that gate because we forgot to do something, we had to pinpoint exactly what we had to do, or what happened, or why we're not getting past this gate. So because because we we we, you know. Once we realized why we couldn't go past this portal or this gate or, you know, go on to the next map. Once we figured that out, then we had to regroup and focus on why, what, blah, 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 and then go back into the into the past to fix the problem. And the problem was because those type of things were still happening. And they were happening in a more covert type of way where it was happening right underneath our noses and uh, we didn't know, which is also why I called it a reptilian stronghold. So that being said, we, we've come back, rewind, now we're eliminating everything because once we get to, once we get to you know, there's there's more things on level 13, 14, 15, 16, blah, 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 blah. And, it, and it's, it's taken thousands of years to get to this point. Mm -hmm. So, um, but that's that's literally what it was. The, the different species underground harvesting the children and the energies weren't um, compatible with that 13th gate, if you would. The 13th board, the 13th map. Because something was wrong, not letting us through. I'm not it doesn't have nothing to do with 12, 13. I'm just giving I, you that I, example. No, no. I think how you're explaining it, I, I get it. I love it because I can understand it. And right. now I see kind of why our memories are wiped because we can't know about that and still do a good job in the present. You know what I mean? That's right. That's right. That's right. That's another reason why I say. You know, we, we volunteered, but we were chosen too. So we were chosen, but we still had to be, you know, volunteer. Right. It's like, hey, do you want to go back there? You were chosen to go back there, but do you want to go back there? Yeah, no, I'm not going back there. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I know I ain't going back there. No way. <laughs> well, no, what you just said, I, I feel like. It has made a world of difference for my comprehension, mine. And I hope that helps everyone that's watching this as well. You know? Yeah. Um, some, some of the, uh, some of the Jedi's I've already explained this to, so they know. Uh, and it, it also um, opened them up to that fact and yeah. reality. And yeah. it's, it's made them stronger too, to, to, to know these certain, these certain things. Yeah. Uh, which, mm -hmm. which is going to happen to everybody else because now we're seeing more, 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 more. Um, remember, like I said in the previous videos, that when dad increases the consciousness level, more information. So that's what's happening. And it, and it doesn't really matter if we got a million views or not, because the right people are watching this. That's right. Whether, yeah. whether it's Jedi's, militaries, um, um, uh, cabal, it don't matter to me. Right. Right. Well, if you're watching this, then you had to watch it, whether you're those types. Mm -hmm. OK, because if you're if you're military, you got some more insight on what you should be doing. If you're, you know, one of the crew members, Jedi's, you got more insight on what you should be doing. And if you're Cabal, then, you know, your ass is dead. So, um, <laughs> Miss the deadline, dude. <laughs> and it don't it don't matter to me who yeah. is who because yeah. I'm gonna keep doing what Daddy wants me to do, and those that are going against Daddy's will for the people will um, cease to exist. No easier way to put it. Yeah. Wow. 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 I love the way you put that. Yeah. So, um, I mean, I could probably ask tons more questions about this. Like, here's one. Will we be seeing dinosaurs? 
like um will we interact with dinosaurs in the future or whatever yes you can you can go to a different portal and visit them okay and they and they won't try to eat you and all this other bullshit because right. they're right. telepathic right um it's you know like like Jurassic Park right they all all they want to do is eat everybody yeah <laughs> well it makes a good movie but um you know well, I I've heard that dinosaurs were intelligent and that they were like uh, purposely killed off, and I don't know if that's true or not. But um, yeah, well, on di in different areas of the, the planets, the planets, yes. Um, if you look at some of the old paintings, there's people riding them. Right, right. So it all it all depends on where, when, and how. But yes, yeah. they were they were they were used. They were pets. Uh, they were killed off, all of the above. Yep, yeah, all of it. Wow. Okay. Hats. Okay. <laughs> I got some. I got some. I got some really, really nice pets myself, and um, uh, people will be able to see them too. Okay. It's going to be so exciting. It is. It is so exciting. But what you've just, the way you've explained this is beautiful like i'm i'm getting it which i like <laughs> but i feel like you've really helped a lot of people by explaining it that way yeah i'm sure everybody will get it i mean it's i've made it so easy and so simple and of course dad is talking through me which is why i gotta watch these things too yeah. um because you know he 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 makes me say things that you know i would have not said because i would have not known right Right. At that time, right? So I've asked da Dad a lot of questions. I mean, since 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 he popped up, right? Since he popped up the way he did, I've asked him millions of questions, millions. Like, you know, why is this? Why is the sky blue? You know, like shit like that. And he would tell me. So it's like, okay, um, because of the different frequencies in the air and blah blah blah, different plants, blah blah blah. blah. The glass dome now it's energetic dome and this and that. Okay, so that's a, that's all of my information comes from that. Now I've also took the time out and did research, like everybody should do. Don't take my word for it. Go research. I've did. I'm a research junkie. I research everything, like everything. Some of disgusting shit too, sometimes. Mm. But I want to know what the fuck is going on. How did how you know? So when I do that, um, he tells me and he shows me. That's why I know so much, and it's coming straight from dad. And if it, if if um, if it's not right, if it's not something that's truthful. I won't even be able to say it, especially on this, because he'll just cut me off. <laughs> he'll just he'll just cut me off. Literally just cut me off. Okay. That was funny because just as you said that, the screen blipped. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's true. Yeah. And and he always corrects us too. Like like just you a little while ago. It is fun, right? This is so much fun. Oh, it is fun. Yeah, yeah. That's that's what he does, especially to me. Like, you know, I, I, especially when I'm talking to certain people and saying certain things, he wants me to get it right. And he wants me to use my words in a way where it manifests things. Right, right. Which is yeah. why I also narrow things down to done. Let's talk. What do you want? What do you need? Okay, done. Yeah. I gotta go. Yeah, I love that. Bye. Love it. Practical, easy. Once you understand the bigger picture, beautiful. That's right. Daddy's Easily. daddy's involved. Daddy is involved in everything I do and say. Yeah. And he's going to make it more and more evident as the days go on. It's a guarantee. It's a guarantee. So he, he is with us, and you know he don't. He, I can't say he don't like some of the things that's happening around the world because there's a purpose for it. And he's allowing it. He's actually created it that way or designed it that way. So it's not like he doesn't like it, but we don't like what he's what's doing. 
and we're also using our energies to manifest it being cleaned up, healed up, resolved. Right. And that's where he's allowing us to participate too. Um, especially those of us that have been going through um, hell just to get to where we're at. Because it hasn't been easy for those of us of the light, if you haven't noticed. Yeah. Definitely mm -hmm. hasn't been easy for any of us. And he's with us. He wants us to know that he is with us which is why he's going to bless us. He's taking everything the dark ones used and giving it to us. This is a guarantee. So that is exciting. <laughs> Very much so exciting. So, so when we get back to that 12th or 13th level or whatever, it's going to be even better this time than it was the last time. You know, right, right. So base more pure, you know. Exactly, exactly. So basically everything on the 12th, level is at pause it's at frozen the video game is frozen at the 12th level because we're back we're here right now right and once once we hit the start button it'll change and the portals open boom off to the next one wow wow <laughs> that's right Okay. So we don't have to like live every level again. We kind of, mm. it's like, um, natural. Like, yeah. Like, and then it's going to be like the uh, beauty and the beast where she kisses him and he transforms. That's literally what I talk about. We're going, we getting ready to transform to ourselves in the future, in the future and the past, because we, we change. We become ourselves. We merge to ourselves. It's wild stuff. It's a lot to take in, but yeah. if you follow, if you follow with me, you you understand more. Right, right. I I go back and I listen to these two or three times because I I always have more questions. I'm like, why didn't I ask this, 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 and this? You know, and you know, we can't go super deep. You know, we can't talk for two hours about one topic. We have to like answer the surface questions, but that leads to more awakening, I think. It, that's true. And even when I get done, it's like, oh, I forgot to say this, or I forgot <laughs> to say that. But but you you're right. Um, it's it's happening the way dad wants it to happen. Yeah. He's the one approving it. Yeah. Um, he's the one telling me to do it. Um, you know, uh 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 I don't I don't do anything without his approval, although I want to. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. It sounds like everything is going to be so beautiful and we just really need to focus on what we're doing, do our healing, be nice to people, live a good life. And we're going to see it unfold. Yeah. We're not going nowhere. Yeah. We're not going nowhere. And for, you know, for those of you that are experiencing some of the shit you're, exper you're experiencing, you need to just pump the brakes, <laughs> relax, clear yourself, realize dad's in control, realize you're being attacked, realize that an attack is nothing but energy and frequencies, clear yourself, bring your energy levels back to normal and get to work. Don't sit there crying about, oh, I'm being attacked, oh, this, oh, that, because I get attacked all day long, mm -hmm. all day long. It doesn't do shit, but it, it happens. You know, my, 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 my phone, my computer, my, you know, those are attacks, right. right? Those are literal attacks, but I can't stop doing what I'm doing because somebody wants to interfere with my devices or somebody wants to mm -hmm. interfere with you know, the car or somebody wants to do shit, right? Mm -hmm. So I know it's an attack. We clear it up and we get back to work quickly because the faster you clear it up and get back to work, the faster you realize the shit fades away. Right, right. And and I keep t t t uh, telling y'all, the faster to get what you want is to help others. So if you're experiencing discomfort or illnesses or whatnot, blah, 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 go help somebody. It's going to fade away. All right. All right. So. 
All right. It feels like we're at a really good breaking spot for today. Is there anything else you wanted to uh, point out? Uh, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. So, mm -hmm. so much, so many good things are happening. Um, 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 uh, watch the news because they're changing their tunes. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, that's happening right now. Um, lots of exposure, ex exposure happening. Uh, lots of people turning on each other. And, um, some of the things that even the Q think that the Q team thought would happen aren't happening. Um, so uh, just uh, keep uh, keep an eye out, keep sharing, keep exposing, and uh, keep healing, keep healing. And uh, when I request to expose certain things, just reinforce it. That's it. That's all we literally have to do. And again, if you're feeling any type of discomfort. Clear yourself up. Realize it's an attack. Realize you work for the boss. And keep it moving. Right. Right. That's, that's the boss. I'm the second boss. Right. <laughs> I am so, so grateful that we did this. Thank you. And thank you for yeah. and all your your effort, your persistence, and, you know, taking the time to explain it. It's like we're at kindergarten level. We need to understand this. And um, I think... It, it, it gives you more confidence, more trust and hope and faith, but then you can, um, I think that rubs off on other people as well. That's exactly the purpose of all these um, videos mm -hmm. and why he wants me to, you know, he wants me to come out and say some of the things that I say. I mean, you know, you, you, you can't say some of the things that I say and, 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 and you know, get away with it if you would, right? <laughs> <laughs> but um, I, I can because I'm for real. Like I'm very real, yeah. and everything that I do and say is because that. Yeah. So mm -hmm. if you wanna, if you want to interfere with what I'm saying, I'm just, I mean, doing and saying, I just, you know, wish you well, <laughs> wish you off too. <laughs> <laughs> I I thank you again for your time and. Uh, appreciate everything you've done for us you too you too i thank you too because you know you're taking time out of your um your life too just to do these things for everybody else too and you're doing work by helping answer their questions so i appreciate you and everybody else too yeah i love you love yeah you. me too me too yeah. i love i love whooping ass so yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, man. but uh yeah everybody everybody enjoy your your family time um we all know the whole you know christmas stuff but we're moving past it dad is changing it all um but mainly enjoy your family and uh we'll see y'all on the next video love y'all thank you love you smarty bye bye-bye <laughs> oops i'm sorry it's taking its time